So I'm going to come, I'm going to rise up and I am going to be the God intended. That's a big root inside of me. The five things God is saying. Number one is concerning the profession and the talents that you have. So God is going to upgrade that. So you have to really press in and trust God that you are composed and capable of doing it and upgrading yourself. Number two, you also have family in mind. Your side of the family, probably your parents, your siblings, and you have this concern that one day or somehow there will be a time that you are more capable to reach out to them and to bless them and when try to meet their needs. Thirdly, it's about your life. You are in a transition. You're in a place of major decision in the area of relationship, in the area of what's going to be next. God is assuring, I will walk with you. I will heal you. I will strengthen you. I will empower you. And in the days to come, you'll find that you are composed, that you are strong in the inside and your perspective are more clear in the will of God and and what and the purpose the way God created you with a purpose that will be fulfilled so don't give up there'll come a time you're going to be blessing others Amen. but this Amen. is the time God is building Amen. you to be stronger fourthly I see the word property and so that is also going to come as a package and one of the things that, that God is showing to me is in the near future this leadership will flow and I see you teaching. Amen. I see you mentoring. Come on. I see you even going back to your own people to mm. educate them, to impart into them. Father, I release your power Amen. and pray for healing. Amen. I pray for an activation of your spirit. Thank you, Lord. And pray that there will be such a lifting in her spirit that she can see from a bird's eye view and Thank you, Father. work on those areas with the power of the Holy Spirit Thank and you. see success in every success with a Amen. of blessing. Amen. Monica, mm. someone broke your heart. And that's fine. Because they may have broken your heart, but that very breaking of your heart saved you from great evil. So what it looked like a bad thing was a good thing. I know you invest greatly in people when you commit, you commit. When you lock, you lock. And so when you put so much into it and it's taken away, it takes a lot from you. But you know what? It was God preserving you. Amen. Dubai was not your first destination. You didn't even really want to come here. Your heart was more in Europe. But you know what God said to you up and he brought you here? Because this is where your destiny really is going to unfold. This is where greatness is going to come. Every dream you thought would be fulfilled in Europe is going to be fulfilled here. So cancel the plans for migration. Don't change location. You've arrived. This is where God wants you to be. Amen. Father, we thank you. Thank you, Lord. We give her settlement. Thank you, Father. We give her peace. We now pray for divine connections with the true relationships she has thank here. You, Father. I know the relationships you have here, you've been hesitating because you've been hurt before. Mm. God says these are new relationships. I have set them. Connect with them. Amen. They are key to where you're going next. Amen. 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 All right.